What's going on, YouTube? Yeah, it's your boy Flex and Rue. I am making this video and just updating y'all on my police case when I got pulled over by the officer and the one she pulled a, a, a weapon to put it towards my head. If y'all haven't watched that video, I highly recommend y'all to watch that video before you watch this one. But you know, this uh, video is just to update y'all what's been going on with the police case and stuff like that. You know, a lot of people have been asking. So I thought I'll just do it. Since I'm right here outside my business, you know, this is my business, I own it, it's my establishment. And that's where I got pulled over at, is right there. Um, when she pulled the gun out and, and put it towards my head. Yeah, so my lawyer, I hired a lawyer, you know, it cost me money. And my lawyer, you know, we came, we was going to court for a long time. You know, we was going to court for a long time. And, you know, we came to agreement with the DA. The DA said, stay out of trouble, talking about me, stay out of trouble for two months and take an eight hour gun safety course class, which I did, I completed. So my charges were dropped. I got my piece back and that's that but the reason why uh, they charged me in the first place was because the gun was transferred improperly meaning that it was in the trunk where it was supposed to be at and uh, the, the, the clip was inside the gun that's why it's not supposed to be inside the gun there wasn't one in the chamber the clip was just inside the gun that's the reason why they charged me but the reason why my charges got dropped because it was an illegal search they have no right to search my vehicle to be able to find it like that so that's what's been going on and um, you know I don't wish that upon nobody you know, I've been going through, uh, you know, things, you know, with that, police encounters and stuff like that. Done and over with. It's the past, but it's always going to stick with me, and it's something I'll never forget. And even to this day, everywhere I go, people, oh, bro, you're the dude from the video, you're the dude from the video. You know, so it's like always, it always gets brought up, even though I don't want it to get brought up, but it's out of my hands. I posted it for on the internet for a reason, so they could see this, what's going on. And especially outside the business, you know, being treated like but yeah, so I don't wish that upon nobody. I appreciate everybody's support, everybody's love, and just, you know, supporting the movement and what I was going through. Yeah, it's all love at the end of the day. You know, y'all like this video, subscribe to this YouTube channel, drop comments if you guys wanna know anything more that happened with that police encounter and what's been going on. So like I said, that's what's been going on. Like, I beat my charges, charge been dropped, stayed out of trouble. I never had a criminal history, never did none of that. But you know, it's crazy. I appreciate everybody's love and support, all the likes, the shares, the views. Uh, the comments people hit me on instagram and just so many you know connections now and just you know it's love it's all love even with those negative energy it's all love you know i ain't worried about none of that i'm still focused on my shit still taking care of my shit and it's your boy flex and rude i appreciate y'all with the journey and um you know i'll continue to still do business behind me and just uh, keep going and progress and elevating myself elevating in life my character my mindset you know i couldn't do it without y'all i appreciate y'all support for all the shares but yeah, that's it for today, yo. Um, so y'all subscribe to this YouTube channel, drop some comments, like this video, and I'll see y'all until next time.